Hello, friends and fellow cat lovers. All right, so I definitely, I couldn't get out of that frozen screen, so I ended up having to stop out, and uh, we redid the day. So I skipped all of that. Uh, mostly the same, I think. I think I hit a couple, uh, I sped run through some of the text, and I probably hit some wrong options that I didn't do previously, but I think by and large it's mostly the same. Okay, there we go. Now she's talking to the construction cat. What'd you say? They said they need bagel energy. Bagels? They're deficient in vitamin bagels. So sleepy. You run the cafe, you might make some bagels. You know what the good news is? Is uh, we have that uh, we have that recipe now. Okay, so let's get on this and we can go back and make some bagels. We're also at like 3.30, so we're significantly earlier uh, in the day. So a fresh batch of bagels. Okay, so yeah, we got the, ba uh, the recipe for that and for something else. I used some of our cash, our ill-gotten proceeds to buy recipes, because that seemed like the wise thing to do. I don't know if this was the quickest route. I think it was the quickest route back down. We will find out. It wasn't too bad. I, Whenever I crash in games, which it doesn't happen very often, um, but typically whenever I have a, a situation like that, I'm always very torn. I'm like, oh, do I just end this series now? <laughs> do I keep going? Because I'm, I'm very... I, I'm not a person that enjoys, like watching movies twice kind of thing i'm very impatient and so when i have to redo things i generally i don't like doing it uh those croissants are not coming along that's how they're coming i've got to do some cooking at any rate it uh this game's quite pleasant so it wasn't a big deal okay i'm gonna go with the bagel now i don't know if we have to what do we need flour i don't know if we have to redo uh like get new ingredients okay yeast uh, do I need sugar? No. Um, egg? Yeah, we need an egg. I don't pick up a strawberry, I pick up an egg. It, you know, definitely the three-point shot it seems to work pretty well with this. Um, just the jump and throw. Uh, okay, so the, all of those things, I need yeast. Which one is yeast? Are you yeast? Yeast. Okay. Oh. No. Alright. And then, no, you were oil, right? Yeah. Who's salt? There's salt. Your people are still doing, they're, they're having a dance party in my cafe right now. That's fine. Okay, that's my fresh backs, batch of bagels. And then, I guess I put it over there. Cool, tell the construction cast the cafe had bagels. Now let's make the croissant while we're at it. Uh, so, okay, so this is good. So our materials are infinite. I like this. No, don't need an apple. What kind of bagel is that, or croissant? No croissant has a, maybe. Uh, some yeast. I think I'm... Oh, no, I did get in. Okay. Butter. I think that missed. Salt. No butter went in. Okay. There we go. Oh, no. I overshot with the salt. Fine. Coming around the other side. He's coming in. Can he hit it? It's going to go off the backboard. And boom. We've got a croissant. Okay. He's coming off the ledge. He's coming around. He's coming over. He's shooting it over. Boom. There we go. Okay, so let's go talk to uh, his buddy here still. Big Papa, hey buddy. Uh, I did the thing. Okay. Oh, I shouldn't be skipping that. Okay. So, all right, and then, you know, there's somebody else for the, they wanted the recipe for their aunt. So what was that? That was the, the roll cake? I think it was a roll cake. So let's grab the flour. Um, it's interesting. I did, uh, since I played here, read uh, a comment. This, uh, people were commenting, or a reviewer, because somebody was commenting, that uh, the cooking was a little fiddly. I don't see it. I, they may have um, adjusted it. I don't know. But it it's weird, for sure. 
<laughs> this is the weirdest cooking thing, but I, it's not bad. I don't mind it. Uh, vanilla. Was that gonna be like this? No, that's tea. Is this? Oh, there's vanilla. Okay, it's like vanilla, um, not extracted, and cream. This must be the cream. Yep. I wonder how North American centric this is in terms of the, uh, the appearance of the goods. Um, there we go. Okay, so we can tell the uh, other people that we have the thing too. Uh, it's not you though, is it? Okay. Okay, uh, we're just gonna go out now. And we'll tell the construction cats. <laughs> like, I just, I had a feeling I was probably on my power wolf, but, uh, you know, you can't be entirely sure. I guess we could have just gone to sleep as well. I don't know. I, I can't recall what time we actually had to go to bed at. Like, if there was a, a firm bedtime, they're like, you're gonna black out now, you better go to bed. I do not remember. Yeah, I'm very curious. Okay, I am curious why the deer glows at night. And uh, I am curious about the... I, I have no idea how big this game is. Like, it's interesting. One, I feel like once you get all the locations opened up, unless it's a lot of, like, just fetch questing, I don't know how excessively big it is. I'm not sure. Cat bagels. Oh, look at that. They've cleared out. Okay. The world is our oyster. Or something. And we've got new cat friends. Okay, hey buddy. Oh, you can't, you can't. Oh. Arctic Fox kind of glows at night too. That's cool. Okay, oh, I see. So the town is filled with little cat peoples. I can't really. Oh, hey, beatboxing. Yeah, this is my favorite. Uh, get it, get down, get down. Party on, my little friends. Wow. Arctic Fox wants in on this. They definitely got the. Uh... <laughs> I like this in Ooblets. Uh, I don't know if they did motion capture or they just are really good at rigging up little animations. Very cute. I have no idea how these things are done. They're all magical, but they're all very cool. Wow, okay, so Cat City is a lot of, like, cats. I, I'm not sure what the deal is to Cat City here. What, what's, uh, what are we looking for? Okay, like, we don't currently have any quests in Cat City. There's the beach. Yeah, the, the cats, it does seem like they're not interested. But there might be other things going on down here. So let's go find out. Now, see this this little catty, this little kitty cat. Who are you? Hey, how are you? Okay, oh, you're a dog. Oh, why did I get another animal? Or, oh, I got $600. No idea. Okay. Well, that was nice. We we found a new friend. And then we'll come around this side and we'll see what this area is all about. Um, oh, it's at 10 o'clock at night. Okay, it's getting late. Oh, look at that. Are we able to get on this? Maybe I am. Maybe I gotta get... Uh... Yeah, oh yeah, there we go. Nice. Why, well, hello. Just me, casually riding a merry-go-round. Hope the arctic fox stuck around. Okay. Oh no, we want to go way out. There's where, that's what we want. We want to be able to see the whole view. Yeah, we're traveling, uh, this is the local version of the London Eye. Very nice. Okay, so we can see that road is not open yet. I don't know if we can... It looks like we can get over to the lighthouse area. I don't know if there's anybody over there. So we found a dog. A lot of cats. Well, the wolf is waiting for me. Isn't that sweet? What are, are all these, like, animals different? Like, that bird, is that a different animal? I guess one could assume it is. 
Okay, and that's, I think... Uh, yes, okay, I can get off there. Okay, let's go up here. Oh, oh, there's, oh, hey, there's a person. Safina, are you my three o'clock meeting? No? How rude of me. I'm Safina, CFO of Cat Corp. My assistant told me that the Heart Village Cafe was reopening under new ownership, so I'm glad we were able to connect. Have you ever thought about opening a franchise of cat cafes? Merchandise, children's cartoons, the possibilities are endless. Let's do lunch sometime. Nice to see you. How's business? Need anything? Oh, great timing. I had something to give you. I've got a new marketing, marketing data from our cat foods groups meetings. We figured out that the cat market, especially business cats, are really fickle. They love to have new combinations of decorations while they're eating, and we think we've figured out the next big trend. Take this list. Put them all uh, put them all up. I know it seems so random, but trust me. Once word gets around, you're going to see the results, at least for a little while. They get bored pretty quick. Okay, I'll give it a try. Thanks. I did the thing. Oh, wait. Uh, it was great. Well, it lasted. Well, of course it was. That's okay. <laughs> Data never lies. Never be afraid to try new combinations. Keeping fresh is a great way to keep your customers happy. Uh, business is good. Invest. Okay. I happen to be working with several promising young business cats who would really appreciate a show of support from a local fellow cat-themed business owner like yourself. Okay. Uh, firstly, there's a Gato Gelato, the cat-themed ice cream shop. Serving flavors like Choco Cat, Paw Berry, Vanilla, and three, uh, all three together as Neapolitan. They need funds for a new display case. They use the Paw Pond twice. Next is Musical Notes, your one-stop shop for records, instruments, and more. They have their inventory, they just need a little help installing good overhead speakers. I love music. Finally is How Are You Feline, an emotional support group for cats that need some money for snacks. That's a nice idea. So what will it be? Gato Gelato needs 400 beans. Okay. Um, yes, I'll invest. Yes, I'll invest. Yes, I'll invest. Okay. All right. Um, okay, that's it. We're gonna find out later about our returns. I gotta know what the ROI is on those things. Do we gotta come after any of the cats for, uh, I don't know, criminal malfeasance or whatever it is we, you're a cat. I thought you were a person. Is there maybe a person up here? Oh, there's a raccoon. That's what there is. Or something. It's a new friend is what it is. Looks like a raccoon to me. Hey, bud. Hey, Trixie. Me and Trixie, we're best friends now. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Yeah, no, it's okay. It's cool. Me and Trixie go back a long way. I'm kidnapping a raccoon. Oh. It's uh, Count Chocula over here. What, uh, what you got going on, bud? The black cape threw me. I thought you were maybe a, uh, a serial villain. Have you seen a dragon around here? No, nothing to worry about. I have the situation completely under control. I do not currently know where the situation is, but I assure you that wherever it is, it's under control. I'm Steve. Hey, it's you. Need anything? Question for you. Do you like cute things? Yeah, who doesn't? I was experimenting with a new potion the other day. It was supposed to clean furniture, you know, remove stains and dust and that sort of thing. Estelle and I have been talking about something like that for a while, but it turns out to be more complicated than you'd think. It didn't work this time either, but as I was working on it, I saw the potential for a potion that turns furniture cute. So I got sidetracked onto working on that one. Hmm. Maybe the reason I never finished the cleaning potion is that I always get sucked into working on something more fun. Anyway, the Cutie City Cutification Potion works. At least I was, it was working. I made a couple of final tweaks to it that I need to test, but I ran out of furniture to test on. If you can believe it, I already used it on all the furniture in my house. Wasn't planning on redecorating until the spring, but here we are. So I could really use to help and find new furniture subjects for testing. Right now I'm curious to see how the potion works on display cases, and since you run the only cafe I know that have at least one, could you bring me a basic display case to test the potion on? I'm sure the cat cafe could use some more cuteness. Sure. Hey, it's you. Need anything? Basic display case. Okay, so we don't have that yet. What is this little character here doing? What are you all about? Whoa, 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 can't let you through official orders from the city. Got a mess of poisonous flowers all up and down the Clover Coast, and nobody's going it until they're taken care of. Oh. Okay. Uh, we can't do anything about these? Ask around the city to find a solution. Huh. That's interesting. Okay, the buddy there just wants to tell us about display cases. We're coming up on a one in the morning. <laughs> I don't know, maybe we're just not going to bed. We got going at a weird hour, so I don't feel it's that imperative to get to sleep. 
we're wired we hit 18 cups of coffee today and i've got a raccoon on my head so life is going like that isn't it hmm what if these uh these cats uh have anything no they got nothing arctic fox oh let's let's ride Okay, let's go down here. Maybe the uh, other person here has something to say about poisonous things. Oh, there's another person here. Okay. Cool. Hello there, Lee. Hey, wait a second. You're new. I'm Lee. We should be friends. We're friends now, and you cleared the way to Heart Village. Maribel's fashion store is the best. We should hang out there sometime. Hey, it's you. Need anything? Actually, I'd like to help with something. It's a little embarrassing, though, and it's a secret, but I know you're trustworthy, so I'll tell you. Did you know that Maribel's birthday is coming up? She hangs out with me in the arcade sometimes, and the last time we were in there, I saw her eyeing this cute new bunny rabbit plushie that just got added to the claw machine. I thought I'd be able to get it for her for her birthday. No problem, but that machine is totally impossible. I've used up literally all my change trying, but I'm so close, I even managed to pick up the rabbit and move it. It's so close to the end. It fell out of my grasp, and I know I'm almost there. Do you think you could lend me some money? 100 beans should be enough. I know it's a lot to ask. Sure. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. I won't let you down. Okay. No, they are not going to help us with that. <laughs> hey, hey, uh, Zen, Shin, Zen. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'm so excited to see a new person in town. I heard you were opening the cafe again. I'm so excited. Please save something sweet for me. Hey, I'm glad I caught you out here. I wanted to ask you a bit about your cafe. Hi, what is it? Well, I was wondering if you could get uh, more variety. Variety never hurts. It can be hard to find your favorite seat. It's comfy for one person and bad for another. So how about it? Could you maybe make sure you got at least three different kinds of chairs? Okay, and we got the chairs already. Okay. Oh, I found a couple more chairs. Why stop at five? Why not keep going? Infinite chairs. Uh, I'd love to get the path to Witching Woods open so I can see my friend Rose again. I want to talk to you about something. Mushrooms, pores, or Lily? Oh yes, I have them right here. She asked me to say hi. She can make it herself. Actually, though, I thought this might happen. Lily works so hard in the flower shop, so I wrote up some instructions for her about what kind of care to give the different spores. Give these to her, okay? Okay, so that's that. They want to get the path open as well. So, was there anybody down? We can go talk to the other person here again. I can't tell if there's other people anymore. <laughs> Nice to see you. How's business? Actually, we could use some outside perspective. We are just discussing where we should have the company getaway this year. I've heard the Golden Grove is lovely this time of year, and so much quieter than the city. Isn't there usually a giant monster living in a Golden Grove? Ha, do you really believe such a rumor? What if we got in the cabin in the mountains? We could spend every day at the hot springs. The hot springs with my co-workers? Like taking a tie off in front of you all. No way, I'm too shy for that. What about the Witching Woods? They said there's a wild cat growing as far as the eye can see. I'm not going to the Witching Woods. I heard there's giant plants that eat cats. We could rent a house in Heart Village. It's so quaint and cozy, and I heard the cat cafe just opened. Best cat cafe on the island. Oh no, no, last time I went to the cat cafe, I, I made a complete fool of myself. I'll never live those pictures down. How about a staycation? We're also blind to the beauty and culture around us. And blind to the beauty and culture, we could be binge watching on TV. This conversation is a staycation. If we want to spend a week in the city or not getting any work done, we'll just keep this conversation going. Clover Coast? Hmm. Scenic beach? Activities? Taking ties off is optional. Yes, Clover Coast is perfect. But all of Clover Coast is off-limits right now, an invasive species of toxic flowers has completely taken over. That's awful. Hmm, I've made it my decision. As the largest company on the island, it is our social responsibility to revitalize the public space. You, the one that's not a cat, as far as I know. Meow? How would you like to work for us as a temporary consultant? Your goal is to make the beach safe again. I was going to anyway. Fantastic. I suggest you start by finding a flower expert. If you need help, you can have all of Cat Corporation's resources at your disposal. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. Oh, I did the thing. Business is great. Here's what you made in your investments. In my business, cats were happy. Oh, good. Nice to see you have business. Need anything? Not right now. All right, so... <laughs> I don't even know any... Uh, find a flower expert. Okay, so we've got to go back home, I think, to talk to our friend. Uh, flower experty person. Because I don't see any more flower experts around here. I think they are probably all back at home. Wow, we made like 10 grand now. Uh, there we go. Over the playground we go. Now the question is, is can we get past all this rubbish? I question that. Is this a new person again? These are definitely, uh, that's a new bird. Come here. Come here, Pidgey. Okay, raccoon. Uh, well, we'll just get on here and let's talk to the, the uh, terrifying child. 
Malcolm. Howdy there, Malcolm. I do Malcolm things in a Malcolm way. Need anything? I could use someone to talk through something with, actually. I feel like it would give me good advice. Here's what's up. There's a big dance competition happening in the city next week, and I've seen posters for it all around town. At first, I was so excited. I love dancing, and this would be the perfect opportunity for me to show that off. But... What's wrong? I'm really nervous. There is going to be a lot of really talented cats competing, and cats are nimble and flexible. This city is teeming over with amazing dancers. What if I just embarrass myself? Uh, what would make you feel more confident? I don't know. Could you give me some feedback? Sure. If I'm really doing this, I need to decide which dance I'm doing. A dancer can only have one move up the sleeve. I have three. Okay, let me see the first one. Here it is. Pretty good. Whoa, look at those moves. That's cool. Let me see another one. See the third one. Okay. Oh, I don't know. Don't burn yourself out. Okay. Okay, Malcolm's just practicing. Alright, I think this is where we head on back up. So, I like that day. That slowly the population increases in the city. I don't even know if I can end up going through here either. We're at 2 in the morning. <laughs> That's perfectly reasonable. Oh, that cleared that route up. And is this... This bunny seems either toxic or... Th no, that was bunny number 5. What? Do bunnies come out at night? Is this a thing? Okay, bunny number 1. <laughs> I'm just going to pick up bunnies and chuck them. Terrible. These poor bunnies. I think we, we saw this bunny already, didn't we? Wow, there are so many bunnies. I don't know if they're nocturnal or what. They're good with the cat. Hey, kitty. Guess what? After I pick these bunnies up, we're going to go for a ride. Okay, Jumbo Cat. Yeah, I feel the cat is quick. Well, that fox is pretty quick, too. Oh, everybody's doing night farming. Oh, that's nice. Okay, let's go get that bunny. Hey, bunny, come here. Okay, listen. Good morning, Starshine. I did the thing. Here's a sample of the sweet rolls that are in the cafe. I'd like to know what you think. Wow, Starshine, you outdid yourself. This might be even better than your aunt's. Wait, don't tell her I said that, I promise, okay? But I could eat a whole batch of these. Um, life's peachy. Oh, I thought these would be my flower experts. What's up, friend? Don't need anything? I guess, I hope Trixie is alright. Okay. Find a flower expert. So that's my new gig. Where'd my cat go? Oh, no. Well, I think that's a good place for us to take a break at any rate. We've stayed up all night. I don't see going back to sleep as an option now. Where are you going? Where are you going? Get back. Get back over here. There we go. Phew. So we'll find a flower expert and we will get on with it if I don't hypnotize you with my kitty cat first. Alright, we'll see you all next time. Till then, bye-bye.